girls and welcome to Garden Guitar. We have this cool song from Absol called Do Better. So it deserves some attention here and uh, that's what we're gonna give it here on Garden Guitar. So uh, I feel that the best way to handle the song is with a capo here set on the second fret. And with that we have five different chords to um, handle here. So uh, let's start this one up to go over with the chords. Okay, so let's look at the first one. It will be an A, but with a C sharp in the bass. So you will get that in the way that you put this um, bar here on the second fret from the D string and down. So that means from the bottom up, four strings like this. And then you just add the fourth fret on A, the A string. Okay, so try to avoid the last E string there in this chord. So you just play in the middle, sort of. And that's the A C chord. The next one we need to handle is the G sharp minor. So you put a bar here on the fourth fret over all strings, and the rest will be six on A and six on D. The next chord will be F sharp minor seven. So you move your bar here to the second fret, crossing all strings there as well, and the rest will be fourth on A. Next chord will be A. So that is open A, second D, second G, second B, and open E. And the final chord will be a B. So you have still now a bar here on the second fret from the A string and down this time. So five strings, you skip the last E string here in the bass. And the rest will be fourth on D, fourth on G, and fourth on B. And there you have the chord, the A, C, the G sharp minor, F sharp minor seven, A, and B. All right, so we're gonna look at the chord progression first, and then I'm gonna give you uh, a different way or yeah, a strumming pattern way of handling this as well. But first, let's just look at the chord progression here. So it's um, yeah, it's a pretty long uh, chord progression here. It's eight chord built upon eight different chords, not different, but eight chords in total. So it starts with the A C, then the G sharp minor, then the F sharp minor seven. And then the A. Okay, so that's the first half. And then you start all over again with the A C chord. And then the G sharp minor. It starts in the same way here. But now you're gonna play the A and then the B. Okay, so you can play this one in the exact way I just played it. So just one down per chord. So it will be like this. This is the rhythm. All right. So you kind of think pair of chords here. So they come like one, two, So that's the rhythm if you just play one down per chord. Um, but you can also play with more downs and I showed you that in the intro of this tutorial. So we're gonna look at two chords here and uh, pair them up and that is what you're gonna do with all these other chords. So it's eight chords in total here. So it will be four pairs. So we're gonna look at the first pairs there, the AC to the G sharp minor. Okay, so the first chord, in this case, the AC chord, you're gonna play six downs plus a clap, okay? So one, two, three, four, five, six, clap. It goes like this, one, two, three, four, five, six, clap, in that tempo, so. 
and then it quickly changed to the next chord in this case the G sharp and play seven downs plus a clap plus one extra down okay so the next one will be one two three four five six seven clap down okay and then you go over to the next pair of chords and play uh, like the next chord will be f sharp minor seven you play again six downs plus a clap and the a seven downs plus clap and plus one okay so slowly it, be, it will be like this okay and then the next chords okay so that is how you keep the rhythm right here six clap then seven clap one that's what you're gonna do through the entire song so i'm gonna play a couple of rounds for you now or actually one round will be enough there you will see for pairs and how to handle and so it goes like this souls do better so play that through the entire song and you're set for this one so good luck with this and play tuned <laughs> 